Welcome to the American Republic, your go-to channel for the latest conservative news updates. Stay informed and please don't forget to subscribe on our YouTube channel. Today, we're going to talk about the latest corruption scandal involving a former Hawaii Democrat, it's no surprise that another Democrat has been rung up on corruption charges. Former State Representative Ty Cullen has been found guilty of taking bribes to influence contracts for raw sewage treatments. It's outrageous that politicians continue to abuse their power for personal gain, as Hawaii was expanding, it was unable to keep up with sewage needs, so the island started to use cesspools to hold the waste. According to reports, Cullen was taking money from a businessman that was looking to get contracts regarding the removal of the cesspools, during his sentencing, Judge Susan Oki Malway reprimanded Cullen before issuing his sentence. Malway stated, this was a grievous breach of public trust on your part. It appears to have been motivated by greed, and it stretched out over a number of years. I am very concerned that this was not a momentary lapse of judgment. Cullen received $30,000 in cash and another $22,000 in casino chips from Milton Choi during a recent conference to sway his vote in the matter. It's clear that he was willing to sell out his constituents for his own personal gain, in addition to getting two years in prison. Cullen was also fined $25,000. It's not enough. Politicians like Cullen must be held accountable for their actions, and the punishment should be severe it's time to stop the corruption in politics. The American people deserve better. We need elected officials who will represent the people's interests, not their own. We must hold our politicians to a higher standard and vote for candidates who put the country first, that's it for today's episode of the American Republic. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more news updates.